On the streets of Lodi, store after non-essential store closed. Fitness gyms and salons shuttered, but not all. We found this car audio shop open, but no one would go on camera. DNL appliances remained open with the owner's daughter saying the business is essential. We still have to provide appliances for the customers like refrigerators, freezers and that sort of thing. And uh, my dad does um, repairs. She says they're sold out of freezers as customers stock up on meat and other food. Another business that remains defiant of the order is the Skydive Lodi Parachute Center here in Acampo. Although we saw no parachutes in the sky, the doors were open. The owner refused to comment. So which businesses are considered essential? According to the State Department of Public Health, gas stations, pharmacies, grocery stores, restaurants, banks, laundromats, and state and local government functions. Is there any enforcement going on at this time? There is not. But the sheriff's department says that could change if necessary for businesses that remain open that shouldn't be. You can face six months in jail and a $1,000 fine for the misdemeanor. Our goal is to make sure that everyone is staying safe, that they are aware of what they are doing. Yeah, usually on Tuesdays, this shop is usually booming. Then there's Fernando Gomez, co-owner of the Razor's Edge Barber Shop, Stay now closed. Good. He was here to clean and stay busy, but worried about his future. My bills keep coming in, and it's hard when money's not flowing in. I'm an individual contractor, so, you know, it is what it is.